It's the freshest food you can ever get. <gasps> wow. I'm so excited. Mmm. It's cooked perfectly. Hello. <laughs> Hi guys, this is Aga and I'm with... Uh, my name is Sudi Ponta. Tudi is one of the best chefs here in Portugal. We found this really cool, unique gem across the streets of Lisbon. And today we're going to cook something together. Yeah, of course. Our restaurant is Taberna do Boiralto. It's, it's located in Tarveja da Bunga Hora, Numuru, and the number is 29 and 27 in Boiralto in Lisbon. Awesome! And what is the best food that you can cook here? Uh, my favorite food is also is octopus. Uh, we make uh, traditional Portuguese food just like the octopus, seafood with rice, bacalao bras. So what are we gonna make? We make the traditional Portuguese food, the octopus. They have so many vitamins and they're actually healthy starches. This is so cool to just be in the kitchen and actually learn from a real chef and see how they make this food. And I love to see that everything here is locally sourced. It's the freshest food you can ever get. <gasps> oh my gosh, it's octopus. <laughs> That's really good. Wow. So for me, the craziest part is how little working space he has and how much he can make with so little ingredients. It's amazing. The simplicity is exactly where it's at with food. So now he's putting the olive oil. Olive oil. How did you start cooking? Was it your parents? Uh, first of all, I'm from Nepal. I work in kitchen more than seven years. And cooking is my everything right now. Is I love to cook. I love to make them new, new food, new, new creation. Wow. So excited! This is gonna be so delicious. Now Sudeep is adding minced garlic to another pan. And he previously he just cooked the potatoes and now he's putting them on olive oil and minced garlic. A little bit of salt. Wow. Now now I, I turn back this. It's a little oh. bit brown and it's a little bit crispy. Fried chickpeas. Chickpeas are really great. They have so much protein. And after that, is inside is the crispy, you know? Yes. And outside is the little bit crunchy. Yeah, what is the right. topping? It's roasted, roasted bread. And that's what I love about Portuguese food. It's not only tastes good, it, it's good for your body and it's good for your soul. What kind of drink would you drink with the octopus? Octopus and the red wine. Is red best. wine pairs yeah. with octopus? Tivelo is the Douro wine. Is it's Portuguese traditional wine, Porto, it's good. Wow. It's also cool that this restaurant, it was found in 1994, and it's yes. a family-owned restaurant. So you guys are all basically like family to each other. Yes. So the chickpeas are ready. Yes, chickpeas is ready. Ooh, the potatoes. Oh my gosh, how beautiful. Look, they're gold. I'm gonna eat that so hard. Wow. And it's so fast too. <laughs> you're a strong man. Wow. Now we need to put a little bit of olive oil. So you're using the towels to get rid of the yes, extra fat. Yes, yes. Now we put the to the floor. Wow. Wow, so we're just adding a little red pepper on there. Thank you so much. Thank it was you so much. Pleasure. This is for you. This is for you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> okay, thank Made you. my day. Now let's go try it. Oh my gosh, this was so fast. Michael, you outdo yourself every time. <laughs> Enjoy the meal. Thank you, Mike. I'm starving. We were walking around so much. Let's see what that is. <gasps> Those are prawns. Thank you. More seafood. I can't say no to that. All right, so now I'm going to try the octopus. Mmm. Wow. This is the best octopus I've ever had. 
The octopus is so fresh, I can literally still taste the sea. <laughs> it is crunchy from the outside. It's chewy, but not too chewy. It's easy to bite through. Mm. Wow. Let's try the potato. Mm. Actually, the chickpeas are the bomb. The shrimp was the selling factor. It's just delicious. Thank you, Michael. We have sangria. This is a red sangria, especially with the octopus and Ooh. the prawns. It's gonna be the best combination ever. The sangria here is probably the best thing ever. This one is made out of the Porto wine. Porto is actually the capital of red wine, so cheers. Let's try some of the best sangria in Portugal. I could just keep drinking this all day, honestly. Cheers. I'm here with my favorite chef in all of Portugal, Sadiq, and his brother, Michael. They both own this beautiful restaurant since 1994. Thank you very much to be visit here. My name is Michael, nice to meet you. We do a nice Portuguese meal here, like a traditional seafood, like octopus, she already had it. This place is actually quite old and more historic, like you can see the tradition, all the things up there. Yeah, and I really love how you guys have the wood connected with the black and white tile. Not only the food is delicious, but the place is super stylish and you guys make sure that every guest here feels like they're treated with respect. It's the best experience you can give them. How can we find you guys? Everybody can search us on uh, TripAdvisor, Google, Instagram. This is a very famous restaurant in Barro Alto. If you search on the Google, it comes in the top Portuguese restaurant in Barro Alto, in Lisbon. Wow. Yeah. If you're ever in Lisbon, Portugal, and you're looking for some really amazing traditional food, make sure you come here and visit Michael and Sadid and see their beautiful restaurant with fresh and authentic foods. Thank you so much one more time for letting me come here to your home. So yeah, my name is Matias, and I come here a lot. You should really come here to Tabana do Bairro Alto. It's well, amazing food, amazing, always amazing people. As I said, really good food, like the gambas here. That's amazing, like one of my favorites. And I always have a creme brulee as well. So I really enjoy coming here a lot, so. Thank you for watching this week's video. Make sure to like and subscribe. And check out our new video and make sure to leave a comment. Have a great day. Bye.